Hello and welcome back guys to another tutorial brought to you by Mac Productions. I'm Hamid and today we'll be going over on how you can get the Windows 10 battery report. This report allows you to see the current usage capacity of your battery and whether if it's time to replace it. So let's go ahead and get started. First thing you want to do is go ahead and right click on the start button and open up Windows PowerShell as admin. If you don't have this as an option, what you might want to do is just type in command on the start menu and right click and run this as an administrator. You can run this command in both PowerShell and command prompt. So what you want to do is type in power uh, CFG and then type in what we want to do, which is battery report where, where the output will go by typing output two quotation marks and then the path. In my case, I'm going to be saving it in my C drive as battery report.html. Once you've done that, go ahead and press enter. And you'll see a response back that the battery life uh, report has been saved in the location you selected. So let's analyze this report. First thing we want to do is uh, ignore this first section because this is just system information. We don't really need that at the moment. If we go down to install batteries, we can see the name of the battery. This is quite useful if we are replacing our battery. We can see our design capacity, which was 83,000 to start off with. But now, since my last full charge, it has only been 53,000. So only 53,000 of the charge capacity has been used. Recent usage is not really that useful. So I'm just going to scroll over it. Battery usage, again, it's not. it doesn't really give you that inf much information. Unless you want to look into that. Usage history is not that useful for me either. What is useful is the battery uh, capacity history. When I first started off using the laptop two years ago, um, I was running at almost the full capacity, which is, you know, around 80,000. If we scroll down after two years, I'm only using 56%. Well, not percent. Let's get the percentage level, actually. Let's do a calculation on that. 56,000 is my current usage divided by my original design capacity, which was 83, which gives me 67%. So I would wait until uh, this number drops to 40% or lower because any lower than 40%, your laptop performance will get affected. And also uh, you won't really have a lot of time running just on battery power. Instead of doing this report, you can just run a simple portable application, which I find really useful, which gives you the same information and it's also displayed a lot better and you don't really have to go around doing any calculations. So if I go ahead and close that, uh, the application I'm talking about is Battery Care Portable. So I'm already, I already have it running. And since it is portable, you can run it whenever you want to and then just right click and exit when you're not using it. Uh, so it makes it pretty useful. And the basic information, we can just see what my current capacity is, which is 100% because I've got it fully charged. I've got it on charge right now. And then the battery time, which it will last me about an hour and 45 minutes. On the detailed information, we can see the model. Uh, again, some of the information we've seen in the Windows reports. And we can see the wear level is around 36%, which kind of reflects the Windows 10 report that we go out, which means I'm, I'm getting about 67% of usage. And that's pretty much it from this video. I hope you found this information useful. I have linked the battery care link in the description down below. Uh, don't forget to subscribe and I'll see you guys in the next video.